This is a little different video for me. Uh, Jim and I are getting ready to go on a, an overnight uh, kayak trip in uh, the back country of Keji. Uh, one thing we're not doing though is uh, uh, pitching a tent or hammocking because we're going to hike into, uh, we're going to kayak in about 10k and portage into a yurt and uh, spend the night in the yurt. It's a primitive yurt. There's no water, electricity, anything like that. It's basically a stove, firewood, and some bunk beds. So we don't need to really worry about shelter, although I think I'm going to stick in. I have a Wenzel two-man tent. I might stick in in case something happens. So we're kind of figuring out, we're both doing the same video, and we're trying to figure out what to bring. So we kind of divvied it up. Um, I'm not putting my clothes out today because um, I'm kind of waiting to see with Hurricane Leslie is on the way up the East Coast and we're not going to go if it hits of course but uh, it may affect the weather here being cold or wet or warmer or whatever so I will be bringing a windbreaker and probably a rain shell uh, I'm going to be kayaking in the same clothes both days I'm just going to dry them out overnight I know I have that luxury and some camp clothes so depending on the weather and what the lows uh, you'll see it in the videos um, so I'm just gonna go through what I'm packing here let's take a camera off the tripod uh, for a sleeping bag I'm bringing my uh, micro light 120 from uh, North 49 it's uh, it's not really a mummy bag I think it's like a combination bag and the good old Walmart blue foamy. I have a couple of dry bags here. So I'm just going to run through. And if there's uh, something you see blatant, um, you know, let me know or give me suggestions. I'm a bit on the heavy side. I think I'm going to pare down a little bit of this. Uh, more packed for um, group scouting kind of things. But here we have uh, toilet paper and a hygiene kit, including camp soap. Uh, some wet wipes and that kind of thing. Uh, my favorite bug spray, Muscal here. That's my first aid kit. That's one thing I'm going to pare down. For two of us, I really don't need that much. Uh, sun hat and sunglasses. I'm being optimistic. The decon container there is my fire kit. In there is uh, a bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm bringing the stove, so I'm bringing my Gigapower uh, Snow Peak, and there's the stove there. That all fits inside of my pot here with the cozy, a little frying pan for the lid. And I have a mug and a bowl. Again, I think I'm going to figure out something to leave home. I might bring it all. Weight's not a big issue this trip. My compass, binoculars, that's the camera I'm bringing there. That's my uh, Kodak D, or sorry, my Canon D10. That's what I do most of my outdoor stuff on. It's shockproof, waterproof, freeze proof. I'm filming it on my ZI6 today, which is not waterproof, so I'm, I'm not going to bring this. Um, Gorillapod. Right there we have my, uh, my R Oregon 450 GPS and my spot um, low, uh, what do you call those satellite personal tracker so that's so I can send okay messages or emergencies if I need to uh, not all this cord is just coming I'm bringing a, a hank for myself and uh, about f uh, 15 feet for Jim for the little project we're doing in Keji um, I, hexagon titanium wood stove in case the stove fails and there's my flashlight and a whistle and one thing I just noticed I forgot to bring up is my water filter I have a MSR uh, is it a uh, can't think what it is now it's the ones like the bicycle pump the Ah, uh, just hang on a sec, I'll go get it. Okay, here's the remaining items. It took a while to find my water filter. I had a 
good idea to put it somewhere and I forgot where. So it's uh, my MSR Mini Works. Uh, we're each bringing a water filter just because it's important. We don't want to take time to boil water. Uh, I'm going to bring my Les Stroud as a knife. Um, I did a field test of that the other day and that video will be out soon. Uh, sunscreen, my lantern for the yurt. Uh, it's a candle lantern and a pack towel. So uh, we've agreed to kind of split up the food. You'll see it kind of as we go along. Uh, he's dehydrating some hamburger and he's going to make like a stew or like a shepherd's pie kind of thing. Uh, we're going to have a couple trail lunches which we'll each make on our own and I'm going to do breakfast. I'll probably uh, make a mountain house scramble eggs kind of thing. Um, I'd like to do the one, the Econo Challenge, use the Ova Easy, but I don't have time to get to Mac right now. And uh, maybe oatmeal and coffee. So uh, let me know what you think, and uh, if there's anything blatantly missing, or you think I'm taking too much. I know I'm taking too much, but uh, I might do another little shoot when I'm out at the yurt. Just what I actually brought, but it should be pretty close to this. So, th thanks for watching your support, and I look forward to your comments. And uh, stay tuned for our excellent adventure.